things I shouldn't know. I've got secrets. Good morning, Stephanie Cameron, the Stock Whisperer, here with today's Daily Dark Pool Whisper of the Day. It is Wednesday, August 17th. All right, let's start with the spy. No new dark pool levels to report on on either the spy russell or the cues yesterday pretty light but guess what we tagged yesterday we tagged the uh, well upper trend line but the 200 simple moving average there in red and we pulled back to the four ema which we've been riding the four ema all the way up so question is what are we going to do today is it going to be a tight day stuck here or are we going to move down to the eight ema which is a very popular pattern which is why you have seen me do this yeah that is my last target retrace to the 8 ema or you know bear below 426 and that is below the recent 427 16 level that we got and uh, bullish above 429.50 if it can break above i call the peanut butter and jelly area right now up here well maybe we'll retest this trend line right here and the 200 simple moving average we'll see that is what i'm watching today all right let's go to the iwm a lot of the stocks are stuck in similar situations bullish above 275 bear below 199 and notice i put retrace to the 8 ema right there popular pattern today qqq same exact situation um, except i didn't put retrace let me do that right now to the 8 ema bullish above 332 bear below 329 keep in mind moving averages move so wherever they are that is going to be support let's head on over to the e-minis bullish above 4285 and bear below 4270 all right we've got uh, the nasdaq futures coming on up bullish above 13,650, bear below 13,500. we're in between that let's check out oil what is oil doing eh, it's kind of flat actually we're going to be bullish above 8850 above this camarilla is a really great trade setup we're going to be bearish below 85 75 below this camarilla right there so this is a big no trading zone in oil let's check out gold futures bullish above 1794 bear below 1783 and we've just gone below by the way yep and hit our first target boom just like that let's go to the next level well 1778 we do have big support right there so if we break below 1777.50 then there could be a big drop there let's head on over to bitcoin futures and i am using the august futures by the way oh uh, yeah bitcoin popped and dropped the 2 a actually the 4 a.m drop i should say uh, we are going to be bullish above 24,200, bear below 23,600. We just went below. The bear below got triggered. All right, let's go to individual stocks. ZIM, integrated shipping. Yep, got uh, hammered this morning. Is it going to uh, be a drop and pop or a drop and drop? Well, we're going to be bullish above 49 for the drop and pop and uh, bear below 46.50 for the drop and drop. Let's check out our favorite stock of the week. It's really our trade of the week. Bed Bath and Beyond. Look at it go. Yeah, I'm really watching this weekly chart here. Had major resistance there yesterday. Yep. Do you think it might jump above that? Anything is possible. Yeah, this is Wall Street. Uh, bullish above 28 today, bear below 24 for a retracement trade. Let's check out Target. Bullish above 176. 
kind of been going a little bit sideways after earnings. Yeah, it kind of it popped, dropped, and then now it's been just chilling out in the middle here. Uh, bear below 173. We'll see which direction uh, she wants to go. Let's go to NU. Massive prints yesterday. I posted them out in the alert tab. Bullish above 6. Bear below 525. Remember those prints were at 570 and 555. We are currently below it. We'll see if it stays there. Apple making the list today. We got some fresh prints on Apple at about 173, 173.11. Remember we had those massive prints, 8 million at like 166.39. Yeah, we're above it, but we had two decent sized prints at this 173 area. So let's see if she could break higher, bullish above 174.20, bear below 171.50. AMD, bullish above 101.06, bear below 98. Looks like it's dipping below that 8 EMA. It did that yesterday, pop back up, but we'll see if it can muster the strength to do that again. Let's see LOW, low. Earnings just like Home Depot was also a great whisper yesterday. It popped and kind of dropped down. So is it going to push higher again? Bullish above 220, really key level. Bear below 215 for a retrace. Let's check out NVIDIA. Big prints yesterday. It's still in splash mode. Keep that in mind. Bullish above 188.50. Bear below 185. There you have it. Those are your whispers. For Wednesday, August 17th, come join me today in the advanced training pit. I'm going to be giving you a little quiz on discipline. How disciplined are you? That is the number one requirement to be a successful trader. So I'm really excited to see where you guys fall on that scale. Until next time, happy trading. My secret